Look right there. Right there. <laughs> this isn't my dog. Don't worry. This is my mom's dog. <laughs> Good morning. Um, welcome back to another video. So we have a lot of fun stuff been going on the last like two and a half weeks. Well, not two and a half weeks since the last video. Um, and we've been staying so busy. Um, I have a huge announcement that's going to come up in my next video. Um, and I've just been like grinding that out. Um, so yeah, anyways, good morning. I just woke up. Um, uh, I thought it'd be fun to kind of like, I talked to my last video about like, how have you been feeling like kind of lost and like with graduating college and then at the same time finishing my bodybuilding show, I just feel like there's just like a void of like, what's the goal? What are we doing? So I've been really intentional about like my morning habits as well as like going out to get work done in the morning, um, going to like a coffee shop, stuff like that. Um, so I'm going to show you, oh my gosh, she's in the protein bars. Um, I'm going to show you all kind of a morning routine, um, and what I've been doing to like be productive. Now I've been doing this every day for the last like week. It's not always like this. Like I give myself like one week, one day a week to wake up at like noon. <laughs> Anyways, it's like 7 a.m. I woke up at like 7, 7.30 and this is where we're starting the day. Okay, and obviously because this is every morning, <laughs> I don't know if you can see what I say, hey. Hi. Uh, me and Parsa are long distance right now, so of course we have to call Parsa to start the day. <laughs> I'm, um, part of, I'm part of the morning routine. Woo! 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 <laughs> okay, so I kind of put a little bit of makeup on. Um, because I am, after I'm done getting all of my other productive things done here, going to go do some work at a coffee shop or something. So I went ahead and put my mascara and eyebrows on and a little bit of blush. Um, we're going to get changed and then I'm going to show you kind of how I've been like starting my day productivity wise. Um, we're going to make some to-do lists and start grinding. Okay. So, um, I went ahead and I had made some coffee, even though I'm going to have more coffee in a little bit. And then I mixed up some greens and reds that I'm just sipping on. And now this is when I kind of plan out my day. Now I found that I'm the most productive before lunch. Like if I get all of my work done before I have to come home for like lunch, then I can go to the gym and I'm like done for the day. Um, and I found I'm like extremely, extremely productive in the morning. Well, not just me. Like some people I know are very productive like later in the day. Um, but... I've been trying, step one for me has been like getting a good sleeping schedule. I tried to make myself go to bed at 9.30. I did not sleep well because of it. Um, but like getting up by 7.30 and starting my day at least. Um, and so I already kind of have been like making a list of everything I have to do the last like this last week because I've been so busy. Um, but I am going to go see a movie with my parents tonight. So I want to have everything done by then. Um, so basically I just kind of make a list of everything I want to get done. May it be at home, may it be somewhere else. Personally for me, I'm so much more productive somewhere else. So, um, I've been going to like different coffee shops in my area and just like trying them out. And that's helped so much to be productive. Um, because how embarrassing is it? Is it like, if you're watching TikToks at a coffee shop, like, why would you do that? But if I was watching TikToks in my room instead of doing work, like who would know? Who would know? Um, so I have a couple of things I wanted to do today. I just make a list of it, um, but I don't try to like overdo it. I feel like in college, what I would do is I put too many things on my list and then nothing would get done. I prioritize like maybe two or three things that are like pretty like intensive because a lot of my stuff have been like longer tasks. I pick two or three things and I'm like, I gotta get these done today. Um, and that has helped me so much to like minimize my list as well as getting things done early in the morning. Um, but yeah, 
So now we have that done. And I have also planned out the next couple days as well, um, which helps me a lot. Um, I write in, I'm sorry for the rambling, I write in my workout. So what I've been doing is I'm like, okay, I put a time I want to be at a coffee shop by, the time I want to be home eating lunch, the time I want to go to the gym, and then anything else. And I feel like people that like are maybe not like me that like don't look forward to going to the gym, making the gym a non-negotiable mainly during the summer and like writing it in your schedule helped me a lot, at least when I was in college. Um, and so that's what I'm going to do today. So I'm like, okay, I have a movie from six to seven or six to eight or whatever, um, with my family. And I'm like, okay, then I need to be at the gym from like two to four. Um, and that way I can like pack and get everything done before then. Um, and then... I'll probably have like a meal before the gym and a meal after the gym and before the movie. Um, and that's kind of how I'll plan out my day. Um, but yeah, all planned. Let's get packed up. I did just change my outfit. Well, not really. I have black sweatpants on. I switched to a black um, tank top. I like looking a little bit put together. I'm going to put something over this just because I get extremely cold at coffee shops and then put some fun shoes on and we'll pack up our bag and I'll show you where we're going today. Okay, also, I've been trying to make sure I'm good about my vitamins, so if y'all want a separate video with, like, the vitamins I'm taking, I can, but I am having, like, probiotics, multivitamins, fish oil, stuff like that, um, so I'm gonna take my vitamins as well this morning, it makes me just feel more accomplished, like a little checklist, so we're gonna take this, this is the fit, I just put my casually has full this special those merch sweatshirt on, and then we just have some dunks, um, I don't know, it's rainy outside. <laughs> okay, I have all my stuff packed. I have my little Boure bag. Isn't it cute? And then this is just y'all, my camera bag. Um, but I literally, I bring a book as well just for like little breaks. But I have my, um, like I was showing you, my little planner, my book, my laptop, any chargers I need. And yeah, off we go. And it's still pretty early. Usually I don't eat breakfast until after I'm done doing work at the coffee shop. Um, but we'll see how we're feeling today. It's about 9. So I'm going to go head over to the coffee shop. It just opened. And yeah. Okay, so we... Oh my gosh. I got a new lens. And I can hold you in my hand. Okay, so we just made it to the coffee shop. It's called Pour Favor. P-O-U-R. Favor. I don't know. Anyways, but they have latte flights, and one of my new friends from the gym is meeting me here, and we're both going to do a little bit of work. Um, so I'm going to show you the little latte flights, but let's go. I'm so excited. Coffee number one. Okay, so this is just a cold brew with sugar free vanilla and sugar free dark chocolate. Not many places have sugar-free chocolate, so, hello. Oh, <laughs> we have a little flight here, all sugar-free. Let's look at the other side. Sugar-free cookie dough, sugar-free dark mocha, sugar-free vanilla. <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, so, it's really dark, but we got them all in sugar-free. They have a sugar-free cookie dough. Kind of tastes like vanilla, not gonna lie. But all of them are like different ones. Like some are latte, some are macchiatos. Ooh, look. Sugar free vanilla macchiato. Mm. They're good. Good vibes. Lots of caffeine. <laughs> okay, so um, I just got pretty much as much uh, work as I could get done. It is now one o'clock and I am starving. So I had two yogurts that I had brought with me and had in there with my coffee, but I am starving. So I'm going to go home and eat and I'm kind of going to make that into my pre-workout meal as well. So I'll show you what is going to be like my first meal. Um, I don't know. I should have eaten before I left, honestly, but like I need a meal prep. I need a meal prep my coffee visits, but um, I had two yogurts while I was there. And then, yeah, now I'm going to go get ready for the gym, but it was very productive. I got a lot done. So. See you in a couple minutes. <laughs> okay, so this is my meal as well as like my pre-workout meal. I have cream of rice with whey and frozen fruit and dark chocolate, as well as some egg whites with some spinach and pico. I'm going to eat this and then we're going to get ready for the gym and get dressed. But yeah, it's around, 
kind of later. It's almost two. Um, definitely starting like the meals a little bit late today, but I mean, now we have all of our work done. The rest of the day, we're just going to chill, which is crazy. Like by two o'clock, we're done with everything. So um, just I've been trying to start my days earlier, like I was saying, and that's helped so much with just like feeling a little bit more like put together um, and just like not all over the place, I guess, because just with like post show and stuff like that and feeling so lost and feeling like I wasn't sure what I was supposed to be doing. Um, I feel like setting these like mental goals and stuff and making my morning productive has totally changed the game for me. Um, so yeah, we're going to change in a minute, but thank you for watching this video. It was definitely kind of short. Um, but I thought it'd be a little bit fun to just kind of show you what we've been doing uh yeah and anyways i love y'all so much uh thank you for watching this video i'll see you next video with a huge announcement um super crazy but yeah love y'all so much and have a great rest of your morning and or night love y'all